We need to go fast to get him off. Jesus, I'm usually not that bad with spiders, but look at it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to do. We're trapped. We are hostage in an iron car by a giant man-eating spider. You reckon I need to go? You gotta get out first. Last night whereabouts was here. You need to get out, <laughs> then come and spot me, and hopefully it's not over there. <laughs> Um, but what if he crawls inside? He won't crawl, that thing gallops, man. That's how big it is. What did you say? Okay, I'm safe. Is he there? No. Right. So the result was we didn't find him. <laughs> he could be anywhere. Where are we going to know now? Just live in fear for the rest of our lives. Basically, the rest of our I feel like the next time we unroll the slag, we're going to be like, oh. Anything. So, we, we will die. It's assured. Here we are with part three of our drama. Oh God, it gets worse. Identify now as spider people. He's on our rooftop tent. Do you reckon it's the same one? No, he's smaller. Nah, yeah, that's oh why God. He's so since the other day, the one underneath the rooftop tent, spiders, this is obviously, because it's all my life is, um, he kind of disappeared and we just hoped for the best that he wasn't in the rooftop tent. And then I was just putting the boat cover on a minute ago. And he literally just like ran straight towards my face. Oh!